benefit from when you start game one of the season, you have a sense of urgency. Everybody has a respect to this game and knows how uh, important each game is. Uh, this isn't caused by any lack of sense of urgency. In fact, a, a sense of urgency can, can make players tight. And I think you want to go out here and play free. I think this is about some young guys on the field with some inexperience. And right now, just um, uh, just just trying to get a little momentum going, hopefully get some offense going and take some pressure off of uh, our pitchers. So that's what this is about. And we'll, you know, we'll, we'll go through it. What was your reaction to Houston? He wasn't yelling at anybody in particular, but just obviously uh, there's, there's, there's uh, like I said, you're always monitoring the frustration level of a team, and I think uh, you know, especially the guys who are down in the bullpen watching and watching some of the things um, you know that happened. We dropped three pop-ups in the last two days. We uh, didn't execute pitches, and we paid a price for it. There's going to be a frustration level that gets there, but so. It's all just part of uh, part of what you need to do during the season, and uh, we'll be okay. What do you tell this frustration now to you? Yeah, I think, I think you, you always want to try to, and that's what we do is, I think the staff always want to try to give direction to a team and give the perspective. There are times in there, you know, and I've been in clubhouses when I play that you don't know if you're ever going to win another game. It's just, it's overwhelming how poorly you're playing. And there are times when you're out there thinking we are not going to lose another game the rest of the year. It's all part of this, this crazy season. It's just the, the ups and downs of it. So I think that I think that um, just to just to try to give team uh, uh, direction, uh, try to um, keep them focused on what the task at hand is, and go out there and, and just play to their capabilities is really an important part of what you do, especially when you're struggling. Is there a, a, do you have a board panic? Or do you have a... I think that's why I think that's why you try to. Give them the, like I said, give them the perspective, give them the direction, so so players don't go out there and try to do too much and get taken even further away from what their goal is. Um, you know, this, is a, this is a different game than a lot of sports, and you need that balance of um, of adrenaline with focus, with the relax, you know, the, the relaxation that uh, lets your confidence come out and, and play on the field. And, and it's um, you know sometimes there's a there, there's, a, there's a little process of getting that balance. Mike, when the rosters are expanded to 40, uh, do you think there's any chance that Taylor Ward might be uh, called up? No, no chance. What kind of reports are you getting from him? Uh, you know, I think that you know, Taylor's an exciting young catcher. Um, I think that he's, um, you know, his future is, uh, is, is very, very bright. But there's a process, especially developing catchers. And to develop catchers, you have to go through and you can't rush it, and uh, when he, when I think when he, uh, you know, one of the advantages he's caught in college, so he's a little further advanced than what a high school catcher might be.